Hey, what's going on guys? Assault here and in this tutorial, I'm gonna talk about the label tag. So, you know, as the name suggests, it just labels like that. Um, so, w the basic definition of this is it just defines a label for button, input, or maker, artwork, progress, like that. And you can use anywhere to replace and bind elements together. So, let's be uh, begin what i'm gonna do is first um uh, use a p tag so choose choose the correct correct answer and now what we're gonna do is we're gonna make uh, options for each so use the label and label for uh, what we're gonna do like uh, and th this will be ta property taker if you want to get property inside that so there will be the value of property so a and a and then uh, input type the we need to specify the ID that is have so uh, what we're gonna do is instead in the type just to use radio yeah it's a type and uh, the in the name just give uh, answer simple as that and in the value just put a and use a br tag because you know you or it will look like a mess of you know so and now what i'm gonna do is just select all and v v instead of here you we're gonna use b so b b and here b here too, we're gonna change into C and place E right. And the moment we're done, you can see it's a radio, and you can do this, but we don't have any summit, you know. So, what we're gonna do create a summit input type, uh, summit, and the uh, we don't need any name. Uja and we're gonna use value will be summit no big s and when you do that you can see a summit button and it uh, the beauty of this is can only select one at a time you need to change that value then you can we take more than that you know so this is the way we can use this kind of thing hope you guys understand see you guys in the next tutorial